Hello, it's Dr. Elizabeth Alter. Today I wanted to talk to you about eye health. Are you familiar with the signs that your eyes may not be doing so well? Some things are obvious, such as discharge, crusting of the eyelashes. These things are some obvious signs that there's an infection or inflammation of the eye. But some other signs are not so obvious. So some things could be uh, what are called floaters, which happen with aging. So floaters are as a result of broken blood vessels. So as we get older, some of the blood vessels become fragile and they can break off. And you, could, you, you may see them by looking at a white wall and you notice almost something floating by. And this can be quite scary for some people and there is um, at times when this can be a problem. So if you see um, a bunch of floaters at once, that could mean something is happening with your blood vessels. But it is normal to have some floaters here and there. I always tell patients to have their eyes checked at least every other year with an optometrist. And then if the optometrist sees something wrong with your eye, they will refer you to a specialist such as a, an ophthalmologist who's a doctor, but they're also a surgeon of the eye. So sometimes there's also confusion uh, between an optometrist and an ophthalmologist. So an optometrist um, does eye, eye checks in terms of the vision, the structure, some of them have some fancier tests than others. They can check your eye for pressure. And then the ophthalmologist, that's the MD that's a, a surgeon, um, an MD or a DO that's a surgeon. So they, they take on the more serious cases um, of, of issues with the eye. So always go to the optometrist at least every other year. If you see a floater here and there, it may be normal, but you always want to have that checkup. And then other more serious things with the eye are seeing flashes. So if you see a flash, um, which I guess could be described as a almost a lightning, if you would, uh, in your visual field, and then it's gone. Um, but if it's per if it persists, it could be something known as retinal detachment. So the back of your eye is a, a layer of cells um, and this this part of your eye known as the retina can detach. So this is a, a serious thing that can lead to a complete loss of your vision. So usually that's the, the flash of light um, and you, you may lose some vision with that. So again, I think as long as you're seeing your optometrist every other year, these things tend to be less scary. And you can always go to an urgent care, although depending on the urgent care, they may not have the proper equipment to fully evaluate your eye, but at least they can reassure you if you can wait to see the optometrist the next business day, or if you need to go to um, an an emergency room for the eye. So here in Miami, we're very fortunate that Baskin Palmer, which is the main eye institute, has an emergency room. So that's always available to for eye emergencies. So the, the more basic issue with your eyes is your intake of antioxidants. So it's really important that you take your multivitamin, your vitamin C, and things like CoQ10 to, to help the overall health of your eye. So things like macular degeneration um, are avoided by taking antioxidants on a regular basis. And so again, your multivitamin, your vitamin C, CoQ10, and our dear old friend glutathione is very important for that as well. Well, I hope this is helpful. And thanks again for following me on Twitter, Facebook, and other social media, and have a healthy day.